Hey guys, I'm Miss Crystal. I'm not only a recording artist, but I'm also an attorney, and I just went through the biggest transformation to date. Now, red hair has been a part of my, not only brand, but also my identity in general for well over 10 years. And so this decision to kind of make this change from having red hair to what is now the majority brown with a little red in the front was a huge decision and it was something that I've been kind of sitting on for the last two years. Now, like I said, I'm not only an artist, but I'm also an attorney. And when I say that, you know, the red hair has been my brand, it really is my brand. And even more so in the field of being an entertainment attorney and kind of being set apart. So there were definitely some, you know, worries that I had and I'm gonna get into all of it in this video and just be really honest and real with you guys, but this is gonna be fun. I'm gonna, ooh, kitty. All right, so Gizmo's joining us. In today's video, I'm gonna give you a reaction going through unreleased footage of the behind the scenes, of the process of changing my hair, which collectively was about a seven hour process. And I'm so excited to go through it with you guys. I'm gonna tell you stories and share a whole lot of stuff. So stick with me. With that being said, let's get into the video. All right, so we went to Salon VIP, but my stylist Angel, who you guys are gonna meet in just a second, his company is Vanity Glam Hair. And Angel has been with me for almost a decade. There he is. <laughs> I love Angel so much. So my hair, incredibly faded. I let it, I was washing it. I wasn't putting color in it. So very, very faded. And then you see all this yellow. And the yellow was because I bleached out this whole section that was previously black. It took me two days and multiple applications of bleach so I at least had that first step done because I knew this was gonna be a long process. So the first step now that we're at the salon is that Angel is putting in what he called uh, a lift. It's not quite bleach, and I don't know what the exact name is, but it's to help start to draw out the red, which is deeply ingrained in my hair at this point. All right, so he's pulled out a little bit that? of the red. I'm getting my hair done. I'm becoming a, a blonde. Do you see my blonde? Do you like blonde girls? I like whatever color hair you have. So you guys just heard, I was talking to our trusty cameraman who is that Orco. He's not only my mans, but he's also my music producer, um, my show producer for my law channel, everything. So that's what I was talking to. And he gave the right answer, right? So if I went blonde, would he be into it? And he said, of course, he's gonna be into whatever I do. <laughs> we don't know if that's true or not, but that's what he said. All right, so now Angel is applying the bleach, which I told him, because he's like, I don't know if I want to apply it. It might be too harsh. I'm like, I don't care. <laughs> Get the red out. So we're doing the bleach, and then you'll see right there in the front, wow, that's not an attractive face. One sec. There we go, a less awful face, but at this part, the bleach and the ammonia is really, really burning my eyes. But the other part of it is that, so now as far as what we're doing in the head, we've applied the bleach to all this section in the back to try to get the red out. The purpose is because when you apply the brown, I didn't want to have the super warm undertone because my natural style, my natural hair color has an ashy undertone. So that's why I was like, we got to get the warm out. But then we also were applying bleach in the front areas so that I could reapply the red and have it pop. So that's what we're seeing there. The ammonia is strong. <laughs> You know how like they say the force is strong? The ammonia is strong. Now this was a pretty long day, so you're gonna see that I start to slowly lose it <laughs> with everything that I say as the day progresses. So he's now washed out the bleach. We're looking a lot better, but obviously it's still pinky orangey, but um, we're at the point where we've pulled a lot of the red. So now we're gonna apply a filler Okay, so the filler is just to put a nice base of that brown tone in the hair before we actually Ooh, apply the color. It's brunette, bitch, it's brunette, bitch, it's brunette. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so for those of you who haven't followed me long enough, um, Ofortuna, right? Carmina Burana, how do you say it? Carmina Burana? It goes dun, 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 dun. 
dun, 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 dun. That's the song that I was singing. So anyway, in my very artistic, you know, expression of how artsy I am, I was just putting some words to that melody. That's what was happening there. Let's keep going. All right, so and then we just had a break where the toner needed to, or the filler, I should say, needed to kind of fill the hair. And so I just took, you know, a chance to practice choreography. And then, of course, had this beautiful dance sequence with Angel. All right, so it looks like we are now washing out the filler. I got like 20 hair washes. <laughs> And I think everyone had left the salon at this point. It was getting so late. All right, first little reveal. All right, so we're seeing, obviously, it's quite dark now in this whole section, but we haven't actually applied the color in the back or in the front. All right, so now this is a red. Guys, real, real quick uh, tip here. So I have a couple of different kind of, you know, branded red tones that I use. And so Angel had this really beautiful red tone, which is a little bit more of like a pink. Um, purpley undertone and I just went with what he was suggesting that we do so that's the color that you currently see in my hair and the one that I have is typically more fire truck red but I loved it it was super beautiful so you're seeing not not only that application here in the front but let's keep going I want you guys to pay attention to how much product he puts in my hair because <laughs> this was a, a learning lesson for me I've been to beauty school, I did that when I was like 16, and I've done my hair the last you know, decade as far as the color. I mean, he just, it was a ton of product. And so at least, you know, now I know I've been going a little light. So there we go, there's the red in the front. We have all that beautiful brown in the back. It's looking super dark. We intentionally went a little bit darker because it's gonna fade since it was bleached. And so uh, we went darker just so it can lift up a little bit over time. All right, so here we go. Now, I thought Angel was just going to like blow my hair, you know, a little bit dry and then I'd be on my way. But this just goes to show how amazing Angel is. And he just always goes above and beyond. So he starts kind of drawing it so we can get an idea. And then I see that he's actually doing a proper blowout, right, with brushes and things like that. I'm not gonna stop him. And then he keeps going and now he starts cutting my hair. And I'm like, well, since you're doing it, I need a little of this, I need a little of that. And I just, ugh. It just looks so cute right away, even with straight hair. And so at this point, I'm like, Angel, I think, you know, we're done, right? We're gonna be heading out. So he's putting textured, this and that in the hair. He's fluffing me up. I'm getting ready to go out. <laughs> Not that I had anywhere to go. So we'll do a little reveal right now. And you can just see that's my natural hair. That's just how it uh, typically dries as far as just being kind of straight. Just super, super cute. I love how it came out. He did such an amazing job, but this is not where he stopped, guys. Okay, this is gonna keep going. I think we went for like another 45 minutes after this. <laughs> so he goes, uh, hey, you know, maybe I can show you how to do this new technique with curling your hair. And I'm like, oh no, it's okay. You know, I'm basically just gonna go home and go to sleep and so we can maybe do this later. And he's like, no, come on, let me show you. So he starts showing me this awesome technique, which by the way, I did today. And it's a beautiful, beautiful technique to do your hair very quickly. I'll have to show you guys. But he did this quick little style on me so we could just kind of do some pictures. I think if you look on the clock right there, it's close to 10. <laughs> At this point, we've been in the salon like five hours, okay? So we're doing another little reveal. My spins, you got to twirl. <laughs> All right, and then of course, this is the final look. So, you know, I have to, of course, before I get into the next little segment, I wanna share a few stories with you guys, but a huge thank you to Angel. I just love him so much. We've been friends for ever, and I was just so happy that I could kind of share this experience with him. I initially asked him to come over to my house. <laughs> I was like, hey, you gotta, you know, help me and I'll take some showers and this and that. He's like, no, you're coming to my salon. I'm not doing that at your house. And I'm so glad that I did, just understanding now how many steps were involves but angel has been on my music video productions you know not since the beginning but you know basically the last 10 years and he has done the majority of my looks in my music videos and i've had these beautiful billowing kind of curls and like my swear music videos i've had these beautiful kind of updos that he's done you know for photo shoots and he styled me for live shows you know we were like meeting up in california for a show so we've had a lot of fun together and look i'm digging how i came out 
Let me know what you guys think. Some of you have been following me for the better part of my career. And so you know the journey that I've been on as far as like my hair and even health stuff. And this is really a journey. And that's why when I started the video, I just wanted to at least touch on the fact that this was a huge decision for me. And I really felt kind of nervous about it, you know, to, to be honest. And I'm so glad that I did it because, you know, at the end of the day, it's just hair, but I think it came out great and I love it. And if you guys haven't seen yet, I released another video on my YouTube channel, just kind of talking about some huge health changes that I made. And so really the last six months have been this huge decision-making process of just becoming a totally new person and just embracing who this new person is. And so that's why I just want to share these moments with you guys and this journey. And of course, you know that I'm giving you updates every day on social media. Make sure to come and follow me on all social media platforms. I'm at Miss Crystal Live. I'm definitely the most active on Instagram and TikTok. And if you're new to the family, it's always amazing to meet you guys. One of the things I am most excited about, especially as I have been recovering and getting better, is that I have all kinds of new music that is coming out very soon, including a new cover song. If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe, turn on those bell notifications, because I'm going live a whole lot more. I have a ton of content coming at you, and I just love you guys so much. So I want you to be a part of my community, so make sure you stay here and be sure to subscribe. All right, you guys, brunette, Miss Crystal, with a little red for branding. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here, but I love your faces. Thank you for being here. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.